We are really going to see a lot of sunshine, but we won't be as hot as those off to the south. That's some good news for us. We really want to keep those temperatures a lot cooler, specifically in those 60s this morning, a lot cooler, bumping to 70 degrees in South Haven. Now we are also going to start to see a little bit of cloud cover passing through right now, some of which in Grand Rapids. But other than that, we're really dealing with patchy fog. We'd see mainly clear skies if that wasn't the case. Winds are out of the southwest at about 5 to 10 miles an hour. But again, that patchy fog is really what's going to get us. We're seeing visibility drop to almost zero in Big Rapids. So if you do live in any of the spots with some poor visibility this morning, pop on those headlights and take it slow. When it comes to satellite and radar, we're seeing clear skies across the board. Another good sign, something that will be exciting for today. Plenty of sunshine is expected within our region. Yesterday we got those rain showers and they've moved off to the east. Right now they have really gained some more strength as they headed off to the east and they're actually triggering some tornado warnings in parts of New York. So really gained strength as it moved off to the east. Luckily for us, it only brought heavy downpours and some gusty winds but we are in the clear when it comes to our future track. We're going to see overall clearing skies throughout the rest of this afternoon. Overall, mostly sunny skies. We'll start to see a chance for a pop up shower, maybe a quick thunderstorm as we head into the overnight tonight into Monday. But the good news is by Monday, clear skies, nothing to worry about precipitation wise, partly to mostly sunny that will continue into Tuesday as well as Wednesday. And our next chance for precipitation really won't arrive until at least Thursday. So we have plenty of time to really enjoy this sunshine. Soak it all in before we have more rain chances for today. High temperatures reach 80 degrees. Partly cloudy skies are expected breezy as some of those winds could pop into the upper teens and ultimately the 20s. It's also going to be hazy. Some of that wildfire smoke making its return to parts of West Michigan which are then of course making it unhealthy for some of uh, our groups here, Ma mainly those who are a little bit older, those who have asthma, those who are children and um, pretty much all of those groups. So you're going to want to avoid some time outdoors. We'll really see the height of our smoke uh, time will mainly be later this afternoon into this evening, pushing on out by the start of the work week with the help of a cold front. When it comes to our temperatures for tonight, temperatures are going to fall mainly into those 60s, couple chances for a quick shower or even again that thunderstorm are possible as we move into the start of the work week. That's where we're going to see those temperatures just dip into those middle 70s a lot cooler for Monday, but that will also feel very refreshing by Tuesday. High temperatures popping back up into those mid to upper 70s, partly cloudy skies both Tuesday into Wednesday temperatures hike back up into the 80s by Wednesday. Then by Thursday, we've got chances for a couple showers and thunderstorms. Those will fizzle out to be just showers by Friday, leaving us with mostly sunny skies by Saturday. Overall temperatures very close to where they should be this time of year. On average, we hit about 83 degrees.